doctor gave me a terrible diagnosis. I had 30 and 70% of hearing loss, and the total I have four surgery on my ears and one on my nose. The recovery lasted longer, and there was just few people who believed that at once I would become a European medalist and, of course, participant of Olympic Games. My relatives did not believe in it. They looked at my surgery and asked, Christina, what kind of athlete you are? My parents thought until the last moment that I would not last in sport, that I would not get in power I needed, and I will give up the idea to become a professional sportsman. But of course, my parents, my relatives, and my grandmother was there always for me and support me and my dreams to become a professional sportsman at their best. Now I can say that sport and support of my loved helped me to cope all difficulties in my life. I remember this hard period when I started to train. It was a period of self-determination and I have been going to train again and again, despite the fact that in my community where I grew up, there was no one normal stadium and sports club. And a lot of young people just sitting on the bench in park and drank alcohol. I also remember my training before my first competition in school corridor because hall was full and there was no one normal place for training. And even my first peer teacher did not believe in my sport progress because I never visit peer classes due to the fact with my ear condition. And when I started to train, I was already almost 15 years old, which is considered late age for professional sport. And just few people can show a really good result if you start to train at this late age. But I kept going. I kept overcoming difficulties. I kept getting stronger psychologically. And I felt after every workout, strange in my muscles and inner strange. And I remember like my inner voice says, I can. I am world university champion and 20 times champion and record holder of the Republic of Belarus. And now more. I don't want to stop. I'm sure that everything is possible in your life and there is that inner I can voice. It shows up usually without exception with those who play sport. This is confirmed not only by my experience, but also by the fact that in 2012 in UK, the running charity was created. The owner, Alex Eagle, is sure that exercise getting people to believe in themselves. This foundation helped to young people who is nowhere to live. Many of them suffer with mental illness. Um, these young men and women are depressed, doubt their own abilities, getting another no when they're trying to find a new job or new place to live. And it seems that everything is in vain and there is no point to do any more effort. But exercise gives them hope. After their first 5, 10 or 20 kilometers, they release they can do a lot. And with this current situation in the world, the state of economy, the pandemic, lockdowns, vaccination, mass anxiety, and eating this anxiety with sugar and alcohol is no wonder why people's level of depression on the rise. An international science team published in The Lancet, the global study of the impact of the COVID-19 pandemic of the people's mental health. In one year, since 2020 to 2021, there was, you can see it, 26% increase in the reported cases of major depressive disorder worldwide, and 28% increase in the number of people with an anxiety disorder. I can see it in my friends, my relatives, and even my followers write me about this in my Instagram. They can't cope with this. This fear 
the constant of pressure from management, authority, media, hopelessness at, and depressed, crushing people and do not them breathe easily. I advise for everyone who has some difficulties in life, exercise first and foremost. If you don't know what to do, just pump your butt. <laughs> This is the best, easiest and most popular remedy for everyone. Both at home or outdoors, and you even don't, know, don't need to go to a gym to do it. <laughs> Exercise works uh, as well as a popular prescri prescription drugs in treating clinical depression and keeping symptoms from coming back, researchers say. The science of Duke University Medical Center tested exercise against the loft in 2000 and they found ability to reduce or eliminate symptoms were about the same. But they found that exercise to do a better job from keeping symptoms from coming back after depression lifted. I collected my top tips for you, and not only in sport, which I try by myself and which on 100% will help you to cope all difficulties in your life. It's also helped me after the last notorious event which happened with me on the Olympic Games in Tokyo. Despite the fact all impossibilities what happened, dismissal from the Olympic Games, forced an urgent move to another country, when it seems that my life go to hell, I didn't not for a moment get depressed. I play sport. And I play sport now. I found a new team here in Warsaw, and a lot of people support me. And even more, I made this into this stage in front of you. I want to solve you my tools, which is maybe don't share all your problems, but will clearly give you stretch to deal with them. First, make 10 or 15 minutes cardio every day or just 100 small jumps when you get up from the bed. Two, take evening walk without phone, around 15 or 30 minutes. Just pay attention on beauty around you, look at it and enjoy it. Three, don't be afraid of your laziness. It's just feeling when your body decides to save your energy. But one thing is when this feeling beats you and other one when you really feel tired and you need to rest. In first case, you should realize that you cannot success without overcoming yourself. You can do much more than you think. Three, find additional motivation. There are a lot of different ways from listen motivation coach or your, on your headphone or enjoy your workout with your friend can inspire you to work harder. Five, exercise in comfortable conditions. Just try to find the place with suitable environment and for sure choose sport which you really enjoy. Because if you uh, found the right sport, then you don't need to force yourself. Sport will clearly help, help, help you to cope all difficulties in your life verified by me, scientists, and those who have already done it. Just remember this simple recommendation. Cardio, walk without phone, don't be afraid of your laziness and do not pity yourself, find additional motivation and train in comfortable condition and choose your sport. And you will see how in two weeks everything will start to change. And your problem will be less like a problem and your world will start transformated and your mood will be better. And of course, you also will look better and your inner voice will say, I can. Thank you.